always watch the shows. I'm a, I'm a housewife in my own right. I'm a stay-at-home mom. I have five children. And I look at that as being my job. And I always used to look to the show and be like, wow, imagine if I got paid to do what I do every day, which is be a housewife. And thanks to Andy Cohen, I do. Now I get to do that. I mean, I always loved the show. I always thought I'd be perfect for the show, only because I am so completely forthright. I mean, I told everybody I went to China. All right, I don't know what about that says pretentious. I really don't. Um, some of the comments, like, you know, they say I'm tacky, I'm this, and it's like, I knew people wouldn't like me. I knew everybody wouldn't like me, but some of the reasons why they're not liking me is not really true to who I am, but I'm sure that's gonna come across soon. And people are starting to come around. Like, now the comments aren't so bad, and they're like, you make me laugh, and, and that's all I really wanna do. I just wanna be here, like, entertain people, and put on a good show, and these women, you know, sometimes we, you put six powerful women together, you're gonna have drama, mm -hmm. and that's just natural. So, it's yeah. exciting to see. The reunion was on fire. It was, Teresa, she was on fire. I mean, I came back at Margaret, every, everything they slapped me at, and everything that Andy asked me to clear up, I kind of felt it was my, my turn to say my side of the story. So I think a lot of things are gonna be cleared up, and it was, it was an explosive reunion, I have to say. I was, I was nervous the whole time, I'm not gonna lie. You know what, I, I don't wanna put words in anybody's mouth. It's really hard for Teresa to even say those words, like to say that she's, you know, gonna go or not gonna go. At this point, she's taking it day by day, and I wish her all the best.